just realised I better not die because I uh, forgot to spend these souls that I'm on right now. Well, where's the fucking guy, man? It's supposed to be a uh, death. Oh, there he is. I nearly called him Death Knight. I can't remember what they're actually called. Dark Wraiths, that's what they're called. Oh my god. Right, we might be in trouble here. There's kind of like a little bit of every enemy in this whole zone in this room. I'll just aggro that. Right, kill this fucking guy first. <gasps> oh, I thought I fell off a cliff for a minute. Excuse me, hang on. Good trade, good trade. <laughs> good trade. <laughs> right. Where's that ghost? I guess it doesn't matter anymore. Hang on. Holy fuck, dude. Well, I found the ghost, he's in the wall. Excuse me, uh, do you actually mind? Thank you. How embarrassing. <gasps> I can kill them in one backstab, that is actually fucking gangster as shit, dude. Oh my god. Please forgive me, that was a lot of foul language in one go, please excuse me. I just, you saw that. You saw how cool that was, man. <laughs> right. Right, we, okay, we need to go just straight down. Ready? Okay. Here. We. Go. Now. If you want to talk about things that trigger my megalophobia. You need not look any further than this fight, man. I might actually sit a little bit further back. Look how fucking... the. What do you call this, man? What do you call this for a megalophobic person, dude? You call this bad? Holy shit, dude. Right, come here, bitch. See, the cool trick here is that they're, they're not actually that big. But... Um, the lack of perspective, the lack of, uh, what would you call it, scale awareness makes it so that these guys are incredibly fucking troubling to look at. Um, <laughs> sorry, the angle I'm sat at is probably really messing with my rig, but you have to understand this is, this is a bad, this is bad for me, man. Okay, please tell me that the next one is far away. I just do this until the next one appears. Makes it easier on my uh, on my soul, man. Huh? Did I kill the next one too fast, or what? Oh, there he is. Jesus, I'm too good at this game now. I think it's the fear is making me better. The fear makes me stronger, man. So, do you see I'm looking at the game on my OBS preview? Because it, it makes it it makes it less scary. <laughs> there we go. Now I have to wait another 10 minutes for the next guy, I think. Ah. <sighs> you guys don't really see like Refi looking to the looking to the right. This is me looking to the right. Wow. There is the new one. This is the last one, I think. Fuck it, I'll just look at this one face on. I'll face my fears for you guys. One easy boss. <laughs> oh man, if it wasn't so frightening for me, as a person with uh, megalophobia. That would be the easiest boss in the history of video games. <laughs> right, where's my friend? There he is. Now, um, if I was doing like a, a lore playthrough, like a story playthrough, I would talk a lot more about this guy, but I'm not going to, for obvious reasons. I'm going to quickly spend my souls though, because I, I don't want to lose them. Basically, this guy's like the oldest gangster on the planet, and he wants to be your friend. Watch this though.
Yeah. Nice big wet slimy throat. How the fuck did you die? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's get to the bottom of this. How did you die? I can't follow you in there. Okay. Well, what about you? How did you die? I can't follow you guys, man. Whatever, dude. I do want to join his covenant, though, because he's really good. He's a gangster. Wait. <gasps> How did you die? Please tell me. <laughs> oh no, he tried to jump over there. Wait, wait, let me see how close he made it. Okay, running start. Good idea. <gasps> oh no, he was so close. <laughs> Idiot. Idiot. Whoa. Wait, you ready? Swallow me! Swallow me! <laughs> Bye! I just got a full set of gear and a weapon. Don't ask me why I did that, because I don't have any humanity anymore. It, in the moment, I really felt like I had to do that. Um, we'll find out if that was a waste of time, like, probably later down the line. Tell you what, though. Hang on. There we go, that's what we want. <sighs> this is what I'm going to use to get my humanity back. <laughs> Somebody needs to die, and... Unfortunately, he's worth more to me in humanity than he is, you know, alive. <laughs> he's worth more as a game currency than he is as a person, so... Change of plans. Hello, Logan. I'm afraid, Logan, that your time's up, dude. We made out. What? You were supposed to give me humanity! Give me more. Give me. The fuck? Who are you? Give me. This old man is useless. Horrible. Horrible old man. He tricked me. I know who I can do instead. Hey, Dommel. Wake up. What the fuck? What is this? Hey, don't stab me in the back when I'm walking away from you. I'm gonna leave you alone, alright? You don't deserve this, alright? Don't. No, you'll kill yourself, dude. You can't. You won't make it, man. You won't make it. Please don't even... What the fuck? Yo, he made it. I think this guy might be some kind of gangster. How the fuck did he clear that? Without jumping. Just dagger just enough I can use the bonfire, alright? Thank you. Uh, I had a moment of weakness there. Um... What the fuck? No, go home, Dommel. Oh my god. Holy fuck, dude. Why is he... Dommel, I need you to go home, alright, dude? My human. No. No, I definitely ain't human. Alright, um... Humanity. What price humanity, am I right? Um... I know where I can get some humanity from. <gasps> Dommel! Fuck off, dude! Jesus, he scared the fuck out of me, man. Hey, did, um... Oh, Dommel went home. Oh, thank fuck for that, dude. He finally took the hint. <laughs> Look, there he is. <laughs> Waiting for my return. Here he is. Come here, baby. Let me show you something funny. Welcome back, Kirk. Oh, he sucks so bad. <laughs> it's not even funny. <laughs> He literally sucks. Oh man, I'm so sorry, Kirk. Bum Starba. Alright, Bum Starby, let's go. Bum Starby, on the demolition derby. Welcome. Welcome to my world. Okay. Let's go, dude. What? What happened to that other one? Okay, me and Bum Starba. Getting the baby Gerbo. Yeah. Me and Bum Sturbo are fucking kicking ass, dude. <gasps> it fucking killed him! You bastard! He was my only friend, fam. Fucking Bum Sturbo, dude. Oh. Oh, dang it. I was kind of hoping that it wouldn't happen this early, but oh well. I'm an egghead now. I thought this would be fun to mess around with this for a bit. You know, 
spice things up. Get myself a fucking egg. Parasite. <laughs> this just shows the inner workings of the brain of Refu. I know how to s spice things up in this game. I'll give myself a fucking brain parasite. <laughs> Hello, friend. <laughs> oh my god, Jesus! <laughs> You're pathetic. Alright, come here, bitch. Nice toes. This guy's actually easier than the one in the asylum. No, the one with the big magic projectiles. Oh, I forgot this guy still does the magic projectiles, just doesn't do him as much. Holy fuck, dude. Nice tum, dude. Let me get a slur up on that tum, tum juice. Notice when you, you hit him in the tum, a bunch of tum juice kind of sluices out. <laughs> Holy shit, dude, that nearly hit me. Ew, he has like kind of like tummy physics. How did I never notice he has like juicy tummy physics? Strange and juicy creature. Bye. Sorry. Spoiler alert on that guy, he kind of sucked. Do you know what? I'm gonna chuck away a bunch of my stuff. Right, there we go. Jesus fucking Christ, look at that thing. That is everything that I don't need for this playthrough. <laughs> That's like almost 200 items. Look at that. It looks like a special item in and of itself. If it looks like if I picked that up, it would give me god mode. Hey. I need you to bite me again. No. No. No, go for it. Yes. Thank you. See, look, he's waking up. This is a fascinating boss um, because it has a ton of really interesting and cool mechanics that you will never see. Right, for starters, I think we're gonna do this. Um, here we go, this is a good arena. Yeah, so all of this lava basically instantly kills you still, so like, actually fighting this guy is like really tricky. Because there's basically nowhere to fight him. But over here is pretty good. This is actually going to be my first time fighting him over here. I usually just do like whatever the cheese strat is. Holy fuck, dude. So, the mechanic is if you cut off one of his centipedes, it becomes its own NPC that has its own attacks. Oh shit, whoops. Ugh, gross, dude. Ew, ew, ew. Um, yeah. So you can see it's walking around there. Now, um, the thing that's quite interesting is that all of these centipede parts, they can regrow. Oh, I died. They can regrow. And, um, they can regrow an infinite amount of times. And you can just have tons of centipede parts walking around. What I didn't know, okay, I was actually kind of pogging a little bit, but I restrained myself. Um, that ring I just got from cutting his tail off, I didn't know that you could get it before you kill him. This actually opens up the fight a lot. You'll see what I mean. You're only supposed to get that ring after you kill him, I didn't know you could get it before. You'll see what this ring does. This ring lets you walk on lava! <laughs> Without instantly dying, it still hurts quite a bit, but that's better than like instantly fucking eating shit. Wow, I didn't know you could do that. You learn something new about this game every time you play it, I swear to god. Whoa, okay, buddy. And then I missed. <gasps> please, 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 no. Ah, 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 gross. And then you're gonna, you're gonna be in big trouble, mister. There we go, I got him, I got him! Exfil, exfil! Right. Well, 
I did that fight differently for the first time in my life. <laughs> I've never done that fight like that way. That's kind of cool. Oh man. Hey, you want to talk about some megalophobia? We're about to go to megalophobia city. Right, now I'm gonna try not to aggro any of these. Because they're honestly more trouble than they're worth. In both like... They don't give very many souls. They're difficult and awkward to fight. And also... Um... Well, they frighten me uh, quite a lot, so... <laughs> As you can see, there's quite a lot of them. <laughs> they're, they're everywhere. They're fucking everywhere. It's horrible. It makes my fucking skin crawl. Look, right. We're gonna make short work of this place. With any luck. What? It was an imposter, dude. Hello, Fate. How's it going, friend? Interesting loadout. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> okay, let's go, dude. I like this guy. I like his setup. He's got like a huge- he's got like a great sword, but then also um, wearing robes and a decorative helmet. It's kind of a cool outfit. I like juxtaposition like gear sets. Alien. Spaceman UFO alien creature. Did you see- did you catch a glimpse of that delicious giant wet throat, dude? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I shouldn't say that. Stuff's like disgusting. Hang on, we'll be alright. Do you want to go down there? I, I mean, I don't mind. Easy. Before she even cast a spell off, man. Right, Kirk, where are you? Kill it. Backstab the motherfucker. <laughs> oh, just bully the little kid, man. Eat shit, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, wait. Yeah, boy. You ready? Now, if this works how I think it will work, I think this guy can help me completely steamroll this boss fight, which I'm hoping he can do. Um, we'll have to get into position, but but if it's the case, this should be incredibly easy. Ugh, such a weird boss. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You take the other one, alright? You take the left one. You take the le- You take- You take the left one, dude. He's got it. He's got the right idea. Right. He's gonna take the left one, I'll take the right one. If we do this right... Come on. Usually, you have to do a bunch of stupid platforming shit to get both of them. Okay, I think I got my one. Can't even play get out. Oh, there we go. And he did his. Nice. Right, let's back out. Right, this is where it gets a bit tricky. I think I can follow this. Oh, he was killed. You were an absolute trooper, man. I'm, I'm in trouble. No! <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> uh, dang it. I thought I had it. Oh, well. Uh, that's not so bad. Is this safe? Oh, my God. Yeah, very little of this arena is safe now. So, the floor is just going to kind of fall apart in, like, random places. There it is. Right. Yes! No! <laughs> it's me again. I just got here. But okay. Kind of rude, but okay. Okay. Yes! Okay. Ew, so gross. So gross, man. Come on. Now, fire fire guy can still get you in here. He can still hit you with fire attacks in here, which I think is really annoying. <laughs> Eat shit, bug. Insect. There we go, I did it. 
I did it. I beat the boss, man. <sighs> oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Going inside of it like this, it um, it really, really messes with my uh, megalophobia. So uh, I'm glad that we're through with this. We've nearly got 40 endurance. How about that? Huh? Well, no shit. I finally evolved. Check this out. Wow, what a great way to end the video that I evolved like this. Hang on, watch this. That replaces my kick attack. Wow, what a badass look. <laughs> look at this badass guy with like the wizard hat and like the, the katana sword and the white armor and then like look at me. Yeah. 